Hey there! In today's video, I'm going to walk you through a complete beginner's tutorial for Gusto Payroll. Whether you're a small business owner or just someone looking for an easy way to handle payroll, this tutorial is for you. Before we jump in, if you haven't signed up for Gusto yet, make sure to check out my link in the description. By signing up with that link, you could get up to $600 back. That's a pretty great incentive to get started, so don't miss out. So let's start with the basics. What exactly is Gusto? Gusto is an all-in-one payroll and HR platform designed specifically for small and medium-sized businesses. It helps you manage payroll, taxes, employee benefits, and much more. So with that overview, let's dive into the Gusto payroll tutorial. All right. Now, let's dive into the sign-up process for Gusto and walk through the questions you will encounter. It is super easy and Gusto will guide you through everything step by step. Once you've entered your basic info and verified your email, Gusto will ask you a series of questions to help tailor your payroll experience. The first question Gusto will ask is, who is your company planning to pay? You will have several options to choose from. Myself, if you're a sole proprietor, employees in the U.S., for businesses with U.S.-based employees, non-U.S. employees if you have international employees, contractors in the U.S. for businesses that pay freelancers or contractors in the U.S., non-U.S. contractors for international freelancers or vendors. Just select the option that best fits your business. Next up, Gusto will ask, how does your company currently run payroll? If you've used payroll software before, you will select that, or you can indicate if this is your first time handling payroll. After that, Gusto wants to know, is your company registered as an employer with the IRS? Now, for those unfamiliar, the IRS stands for the Internal Revenue Service. This is the government agency responsible for collecting federal taxes in the U.S. You will need to be registered with the IRS to run payroll as they handle all the tax filings and payments. If you're not sure if you're registered yet, don't worry, Gusto will guide you through that process if needed. The next question you will see is, do you have a company bank account? This is important because Gusto will use your bank account to handle payroll, including paying your employees and contractors. If you don't have a company bank account yet, you will need to set one up to continue. And then Gusto will ask, have you already hired your first team member? Just select yes if you've already onboarded your first employee or contractor, or no if you're still in the process of hiring. After that, you will be asked how many team members in the U.S. are you planning to pay? Simply enter the number of people you will be paying through Gusto. They will also ask in which states in the U.S. do you and your employees work. This is key for determining the payroll taxes and regulations specific to the states where your business operates. It's important to list all states where you have employees working as Gusto needs info to ensure they file the correct state taxes. Other questions that come up are pretty self-explanatory, like general business details, so don't worry, they're all straightforward. Now, fast forward, once you've answered the questions, the next step is to add your payroll details. This includes a few key pieces of information. First, addresses. You will need to enter your business address as well as the addresses of any employees or contractors. Make sure this information is accurate because it is used for tax filings and compliance. Next, we have federal tax info. This is where you will input your EIN or your employer identification number, which is your business's tax ID. If you're not sure where to find it, it's usually on your IRS documents. If you don't have one yet, you can easily apply for it on the IRS website. Now we have filing address. This is the address Gusto will use for filing your business's taxes. Often, it's the same as your business address, but make sure everything is up-to-date and correct. Now, for bank account, 
for payroll processing, you will need to connect your bank account. Gusto offers two options. So you can use Plaid. This is the easiest option. It allows you to securely connect your bank account within just a few minutes. Or if you prefer, you can manually verify your bank account. Gusto will deposit two small amounts into your account within one to two business days. Once the amounts appear, you will simply verify them in Gusto and you're all set. Now for pay schedule, you will choose how often you want to run payroll, whether it's weekly, bi-weekly, semi-monthly, or monthly. Select the schedule that aligns best with your cash flow and employee expectations. And we also have signatory. The signatory is the person authorized to sign payroll and tax documents on behalf of your company. This is usually the business owner or an authorized executive. And that's it. Once you've entered all these details, Gusto will guide you through finalizing your setup and you will be ready to start running payroll in no time. It's a pretty smooth process and Gusto does a great job of guiding you step by step. So don't worry if this is your first time handling payroll. And by the way, if you haven't signed up for Gusto yet, now's a great time to do so. Remember, if you see my link down below, you could get up to $600 back with your sign up. It's an awesome way to get started, so don't miss out. Now that you're set up, let's talk about the pricing plans because Gusto offers several options depending on the needs of your business. They have three main pricing tiers. Simple plan. This is great for small teams and businesses that only need basic payroll. It covers full-service payroll, including automatic tax filing and unlimited payrolls. This plan is priced at around $40 per month plus $6 per employee. If you're a small business with just a handful of employees, this is a solid cost-effective option. Next, they also have Plus Plan. So this plan gives you more advanced features, including time tracking and PTO management. It's ideal if you're looking for more comprehensive HR and payroll solution. This plan comes in at $60 per month plus $9 per employee. Then they also have a premium plan. This is for larger teams or businesses with more complex needs. It includes all the advanced payroll and HR features, as well as personalized support from Gusto's HR experts. Pricing for this plan is custom, so you'll need to contact Gusto for a quote. If you're just starting out, I recommend a simple plan because it has everything you need to run payroll smoothly without any extra bells and whistles. But if you're managing a bigger team or planning to grow, the plus plan might be a better fit as it scales with your needs. If you're ready to get started, don't forget to use my link in the description below. You can get up to $600 back when you sign up. Trust me, it's an easy way to save some cash while setting your business up for success. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.